Live from the studio at the Northwest Florida School of Biblical Studies, this is Have a Bible Question, where you are part of the program. Now, let's go to the Bible for answers to your Bible questions. The Have a Bible Question television program that we have produced is now back on in the Pensacola area. And um, then we also have the uh, have it on in the Tallahassee area. And this was the this past Sunday was the first Sunday getting back on. And Ray and Jeff had to come in here on Friday and do some last minute. And it's back by request. Uh, yeah, yeah, Tallahassee so. was by request. That's wonderful. Um, well, I understand also request even from around here that there's been a lot of people asking for it. I know members at Margaret Street have asked me what happened to the program. So. Now I can tell I can steer on that direction. So we're still excited about the good news today, the partnership with them, but to be able to expand this as well, we're very excited about it. If you want to know more information about that, you look on Facebook on the Have a Bible Question Facebook page or go to Northwest Florida NWFSBS dot org mm -hmm. and there at HBQ you can see all this information about where it is available on the different channels and things like and the timing. Because it's really neat. We have the T V program, we have the podcast. Uh, we actually have a radio program that goes out five minutes every day uh, on w, um, FPL, WPFL, PFL, WPFL yeah. uh, out of Flomanton. 105.1. Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then, all right, what did I mention? Sorry. Podcast. And then this live on Tuesday night. So I have a Bible question. As a work of Northwest Florida has really turned into a, a, a big part of our work. And, um, you know, we're seeing people learn the gospel. And uh, it's, it's, it's an exciting thing. In fact, we are working on a contract to possibly go into a very large market with have a Bible question up in the Kentucky, Southern Illinois, Tennessee, Missouri area. And so hopefully that's going to happen, but it's only made possible because of good individuals, Christians and, and congregations that, that support our work here. And I hope they do see the value in it because uh, I get comments all the time from different members and uh, different people that it helps them. Uh, there's people listening to it all across the country. I can name names of people that are listening to the podcast afterwards, uh, when they're driving down the road and that way they have something to listen to that's spiritual, that's dealing with spiritual things and asking honest questions with Bible answers. 